Present to you, Bishop Dr. W.F. Houston, Jr. Praise the Lord, beloved. Welcome to CHOL Bible Fellowship. I pray that your time here will bring you joy, love, peace, and relief. A Bible verse for today will be John 10.10, 10, and I'll be reading from the New Living Translation. And it reads in this manner, it says, The thief's purpose is to steal and kill and destroy. My purpose is to give them a rich and satisfying life. You know, beloved, there are so many people today who are living in a justice system. You know, they have a mindset that says, If I can just get through it today or if I can just get by. And, you know, sure, there are some seasons that are more difficult than others. I'll grant that. And sometimes it's challenging to, you know, get a vision for the future. But if you're constantly living with a just-to-exist mentality, you're actually missing out on God's best. You see, the scripture doesn't say Jesus came so you could survive. No, It says that he came to give you a rich and satisfying life. Beloved, if you're living in a just to exist method right now, I believe that today can be your turning point. If you just take a step of faith and begin to declare my days of just to exist are over, my days of prospering have begun then I believe God will meet your faith. I believe he'll open an unexpected door for you. I believe that he'll pour out his favor and blessings on you. I believe that he'll make a way where you thought there could never, ever be a way. Beloved, even if you're in tough times right now, just remember, tough times don't last always. But the word of the Lord stands forever. So, beloved, affirm what God says about your circumstances because you're created for more than to just get by. You're created to prosper. Amen. Amen. Will you pray with me right now? Let's pray. Dear Heavenly Father, Thank you for giving us a rich and satisfying life through Jesus Christ. 
Lord God, I believe that you have a good plan for the future for everyone listening. I declare that their days of a uh, rich and satisfying life has begun as they continue to put their faith and trust in you alone. Thank you, Lord. In Jesus' mighty name, I pray. Amen. And amen. Thank you for praying with me. Beloved, you know, the best use of life is love. And the best expression of love is time. And the best time to love is now. So today, reach out to someone you love and tell them you love them. Because telling them later just might be too late. Have a blessed day, everyone. Bible fellowship, C-H-O-L.